Hi guys, welcome to TCR. Sid here, thanks for clicking on the video. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Today, we're gonna take you through processing some Coturnix quail that uh, we did. It's gonna be a quick and dirty, down and easy, fast version for you. We've got all our stuff here. We've got our scalding pot. We're gonna do them a couple different ways. We're gonna do some that we're gonna scald and pluck. So we've got our scalding water uh, at about, it'll be about 155 uh, by the time we get started. We've got our ice chest with our ice salted down, our thermometer so we can check our scalding water, a pair of really good uh, shears and a few trash bags to get us started here and a hose. You always gotta have running water when you're doing this kind of thing. So there's two ways to do these birds. One is to uh, essentially skin them, and one of them is to pluck them. Both start with quickly dispatching the bird, uh, and that is gonna be done with a pair of poultry shears, and off with the head. Then we need to bleed it out. All right, so I've got my scalding pot here. Uh, it's about 160 degrees. I'm gonna go ahead and scald this for a few seconds. There's a little bit of dish soap in here. And I'm gonna get to plucking. These feathers just come right out. Rinse this off a little bit in my clean water to get the feathers off so I can see what's actually still stuck to the bird versus versus what's uh, actually still attached. After Sid has done that, I have another set of poultry shears here that are, don't have the feathers all over them. I'm gonna nip off the legs, like so, and then I'm gonna spatchcock this, all right? Which means I'm gonna cut the, the spine out. I'm gonna start right here and get it in and go right down the side of the spine all the way to the top and then I'm gonna find the other side of the spine all the way down okay now I'm gonna get a hold of the neck the spine uh, all of the innards and pull all that out, okay? And got some lungs up here in the rib cage. I wanna get those out. This is for presentation of essentially a whole bird. This is definitely a more time consuming method of cleaning the bird, but uh, for, that, for that occasional nice presentation, we're just doing a percentage of them this way. So then we get a hold of this stuff right here. And out it comes. That one was definitely a boy. It was. Okay, I've got another. Didn't quite get everything. There's a heart right there. Bitty, bitty heart. And then a little rinse. I'll give it another look. Make sure everything's out of the inside. Now look at that presentation. Boom. Right, a couple of those on a plate, cook nicely, beautiful. Put it in the ice. And we're gonna nip the wings off, okay? So right at the base of the wing, I'm just gonna nip that right off. That one, flip it over, same thing. Find the base of the wing, nip it right off. Then same thing with the legs, right at that joint there, boom. So now what we're gonna do is just skin it out. So I'm just gonna grab a hold, like right where the chest is, and just tear the skin. Boom, just like that, look at that, right? Now I'm just gonna pull the skin off the whole bird, all the way around. The legs are just gonna pop, they're just gonna pull right out, watch this, boom. Leg just comes right out of the skin. Nice and easy. 
if this were a, a dove, I would probably only take the, the breast, but there's a little bit of meat on the quail legs and we're gonna we're, we're not gonna waste that okay so we're gonna get all these and then come the rest of the skin on the upper body pull it right off then there's this patch on the back that for whatever reason the skin doesn't want to pull off of but I just get as much of the feathers out of there. Grab this ch chest and peel it up to the top like this, okay? Separating that from the spine and neck. And then just pull it right off. There's your beautiful breast meat. We've got all of our insides still attached to the spine here, so I'm gonna get those pulled out. Not a lot of meat there, however, a lot of flavor. So there it is. That's the easiest, quickest way to do it. There's an even quicker way if you wanna be wasteful, which is to only save the breast. That's how you take those guys from being your breeders to being happy meat on your plate. Don't forget to like the video guys, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell so you get the notifications.